Hi everybody, welcome to George Moore Chevrolet. My name is Sam Martin. I'll be showing you this 2019 Silverado RST. If you guys are familiar with Chevy's trims, the Silverado RST is your rally sport truck. So you're gonna have all of these uh, color match accents on the body. There's no chrome uh, on this Silverado at all. It is in the summer white exterior color. So as you can see, there is uh, it is placed all over your grill, all in your accents. Coming around the side of the vehicle over here, you have 275s. Um, with those Chevy uh, silver and uh, gray rims. Of course, it is packed in a 5.3 liter uh, V8 Ecotec 3 as paired to a uh, eight-speed automatic transmission. As well as the interior, you have black leather. Let's take a quick peek at it. This is a certified vehicle with a six-year, 100,000-mile engine and powertrain warranty and a one-year, 12,000-mile bumper-to-bumper. That also includes your first oil change on us. It is in the crew cab configuration, so plenty of space for your passengers back there. You have a tonneau cover, plenty of space in there as well, and of course, the piston assisted tailgate, so it weighs nothing to lift back over. As far as the rear, you have all your connectors for your trailering applications, and of course, your RST badging. RST, we're gonna start off here at the very top as we usually do. This is an OnStar enabled vehicle with an anti-theft vehicle recovery and engine kill system, which all we connected through OnStar to your phone. That also includes an app that allows you control of the set truck. Uh, remote start, lock on lock, uh, light flash, location, etc., including also a code checker. Down from that, in terms of your infotainment system, you have this 8 inch screen with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, a trailering system, very responsive display, camera access too, with a HD rear camera, and of course, it does have trajectory assist and a trailer alignment mode. Going back to the home button, you have your standard Bluetooth connectivity too for older phones or devices that depend on Bluetooth. And then down from that, you have your dual zone control temperature system, including your uh, heated seats for passenger and driver. Auto stop can be toggled off. For those of you who aren't familiar with auto stop, it means the vehicle will go into a reduced power mode whenever you're sitting for a long period of time, maybe at a red light. You have your tailgate deployment right in here, trailer braking controller right over here, USB, USB-C, um, sorry, USB-C and USB, as well as a 12-volt connector and a full-size connector. As far as space, plenty of it over here in this area. Right here, you have a very spacious center compartment with an aux connector, USB and USB-C extra. Leather wrapped steering wheel with a heating uh, mode right here, cruise control, voice commands right on this side. You have a sports mode, tow and haul mode, and of course, you have your auto uh, two-speed transfer case, which means a uh, when the vehicle detects any slippage, it will go into four-wheel drive, two to four-wheel uh, drive in a terrain mode. As far as the transmission, you can put it in a pseudo manual mode if you prefer to shift your gears manually with the plus and minus signs. And if we take a look at the back, we can see how much space we're working with as far as our passengers. Plenty of space in the back with that leather uh, interior and those second row seats are uh, lift up. So you can simply lift them up and you have extra space. So overall, is this, if this vehicle seems like a right fit for you guys, if you're looking for a fuel efficient engine that's still V8 powered and has about 10,000 pounds of towing capacity, um, Come down to George Moore Chevrolet and see me, Sam Martin. Hopefully, we can have Jersey will be home.